All right, folks. We're over here at um, the old Whitney boat launch in uh, Baden Lake. And we're going to go see what we can do out there. Again, if you guys like, uh, hit that like button. Uh, subscribe. Uh, tell a friend. And remember, when we get to that thousand subscriber, uh, you know, I'll do some kind of free giveaway for that custom rod and i keep you guys updated on it all right all right see you guys we'll show you guys what is going to be on this lake all right Go to the back. Oh, yeah. yeah. Looks like he got fourteen. Fish to, to pick it up quick, man. Got him. Got him. Been on the shallow side over here. I don't know what they're doing on this side of the shallow side, but they're really supposed to be in this current. I don't know if they're just taking a break or oh, what, but they're big too. Even now he's 14. Yeah. All right. All right. Open it for me, Aaron. Open it for me. Get up. Yeah. There you go. Got him that time. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah my son got one too. Yeah. Oh man, these are some big white bass this morning. Oh, my gosh. I tell you guys, man, these things put up a fight. I'm hoping to catch a hybrid. This man, this guy's big too. Look at that. Oh, Aaron, look at this. No. Look at this. No, I don't got a hybrid. But look at this. Oh my gosh. This guy's probably oh pushing God. like 16. Nuh uh. They're on these rocks, Aaron. Got him, Aaron. Man, I think these bigger ones are over here on this side. Aaron, put on your riser. I got him. Oh, you already got him? Man. Yeah, you can't lose that riser, man. Yeah, there it goes. Oh man, this guy, these guys are just nothing but big keepers, man. Right. I'm swallowing this bait. So they're on this back side right here towards these rocks. And 
know, I think these that bird is that bird is my son's killing them right now too. Man, they're exploding everywhere over here on this side. Oh my God, I got a giant one. Yep, my son's got a big old giant too. Ooh, got a striper. Got a nice truck. Got a nice striper on this one. Oh, there you go. He wasn't gonna make it anyway. All right, I got a new bait that I want to use. Don't worry, Aaron. I think it's big as yours. Yep. Go ahead, put him away. Yeah. All right. Ooh. All right. All right. I know that works. This one's a oh, mega bass. Mega bass, whatever it's called. How you? I'm saying it right. But let's just see. I've been wanting to try this one. It's more like a little walk the dog type. I know. Got him. Golly, dude. This is the Mega Bass. So this today's episode is going to be the Mega Bass versus the Jocko Riser. Man, dude, there's a whole many of them. All right, Aaron. Yeah, you should put on your 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 that riser bait. bait, and then you should be a versus, so versus, versus the mega bass. All right. I hold up. Look, no. This is the mega bass, but it's okay. My son's got a rooster tail, a yellow rooster tail, and they're doing real good too. I think this was like a reaction bite. I don't. Oh, had to take that. Take take back. I'll take that back. He hit. They hit that thing twice. Oh man. They're pretty aggressive. Pretty aggressive with this this bait right here. I don't know, but I get I I show you guys a review after the after the show what I've been using. It's like just exactly like what the, what they're eating right now too. You know, they're just they're just yep. My son got pretty good sized one right now too. I got them too. Man, they walked the dog. Woo wee. I don't know who's better now today. The Mega Bass or the Jackal. And they loved it too. Look at that. This guy. This guy hammered it. He wanted it. But I can tell just from looking, Mega Bass hooks is okay. I don't I'm not a big fan of their hooks. Um, other than that. You know, but these white bass, they're, they're just like staged over here on this side of the, the rocks. And man, when they're coming out to get it, man, they're smashing it. 
Um, I do see some difference in this lure and uh, the Jacko riser. Um, I honestly think the Jacko riser has a little bit more action and I think the fish reacts a little bit better to it. But who knows, we'll see. I probably might not be working the this bait right for all I know. But from, from a distance here, from what I'm looking, uh, it looks like it's walking the dog. Oh, oh, I had a hit, I had a smash. I had another smash. dog pretty good oh man oh my god and they hit that thing twice i got them as soon as i got over there man they're just like go ahead Aaron. throw it over there Oh, my son's got one too. Double the trouble. I got that one. Yeah. <laughs> man, this guy held a whole mouthful of it, man. Damn, boy, you're this. This thing's going out drag. Look at that. Gotta get these hooks out. Right, time to go. Remember, guys, out here, I got the Mega Bass uh, X Dog or dog eggs or whatever it's called and it's a real huge bait they will not they will not look at it but if you throw these little bit of smaller baits smaller top waters oh man they, they, these guys over here they'll smash they'll smash it without hesitation and uh you can see my son's using the jacko riser and he's got a striper on right now too he's got another striper I think I think the the bite is just not it's just not really there you know I think they like it they do like it but I'll probably throw like three casts to get one bite and my son I throw every cast. almost like every cast you gotta be careful with these hooks they are sharp And these look just like the shad or minnow, or whatever it is out there that they're they're chasing. And we're matching the hatch. That's why we're getting a lot of a lot of bites compared to like you know you come in here and you want to uh, throw bigger baits. Yeah, I, I'll, I'll give you guys an advice. If you guys do come out here, maybe it's somewhere else, but over here you have to bring small profile baits to get them. If you don't, they'll blow up all day and you might get lucky. You might get one. You might get one. Oh, oh my God. Come on, dude. Come on. Yes. Let you be the, let you be the big striper or big white bass. You smashed that thing like you wanted it too. Yep. It's a keeper too. Keep her white bass. Oh, gotta be careful with these hooks. Extra careful. Extra, extra careful.
Look at that. My son's got another one on the riser bait. And I'm telling you guys, uh, these JDM lures, man, they're just something. There's just nothing like it, to be honest. Um, I know some people will be kind of like. Yeah. Gotta be careful, man. You almost got that hook in your head. Yeah, but these JDM lures, man, uh, they're just something, man. Um, see, I just got a bite right now. I got another bite. But uh, these JDM lures, I can just tell you guys, they're expensive, but they're expensive for a reason. I think, you know, my honest opinion, them Japanese guys, man, they put a lot of thought into these, uh, these lures. And, uh, man, and the only thing I can just say, just keep making them, man. Just keep making them. Because uh, these fish about see everything, jerk bait, uh, you name it, crank bait, top water, walk the dog. But sometimes it's just something about that difference. And uh, it'll, it'll get these fish to trigger to a bite. Man, we're having a good morning already. Oh, oh remember that? Yeah, oh my god that was a big ass bike right there excuse my french but there goes my son he's getting it and he's getting it too and they're blowing up over here on this side of the Oh my god, dude, come on, yo. Yeah, what's up? I got, oh. I got a striper. You got a striper? Oh yeah, my son's got a striper. Man, we be catching the crap out of the stripers today. Whoa, oh, be come, on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh yeah, dude, this guy is big. Dude, this is a big old white bass. Yes. Come here, mama. We were... We were looking for you. And my son made a quick... I got him. I touched him, but he got me back. My son made a quick release on the... On that little striper. Got me. Gotta be careful, baby. Another big size. And then my son's got another one. Man, I don't know how he's doing it, but he's got another one, and they're over here on these rocks again, and I think they're just staging. I haven't seen him in a while. Oh! Got my cousin over there, but he doesn't realize that the the, the striper and the white bass are over here on the rocks. 13 half. I was looking at my cousin. I was looking at my cousin and uh, this, this fish just slurped it up. And he did too. And he's gonna go home with us. They just... I 
he will. Nope, take that back. He just a cab under 14. Oh. All right, and look, son's got him in. Ooh, I think that's a 14, Aaron. Definitely a 14. Yeah. Oh, oh, I have a chaser, but not a committer. I have a chaser, but not a committer. Turn on it. Come on, Aaron. See if you can get him. Come on. Oh man, I had like two bites. Two bites. And then my son got him. Tell you. You never know, man. Color, color carpet makes a difference. Get him there. Oh man, man! Oh, dude, I got a striper, yo. Yeah, striper. Yeah, I got a oh, striper. Dude, the biggest one today. The biggest striper today. Oh, dang, yo. <sighs> yep. I like to see these guys go back. If they're big enough, we'll keep them. But they're not big enough. So they get to go. Look at it. That's a nice size striper. Oh. Look, and my son got one again. But I do think uh, the color does make a difference though. Um, even with this riser bone white, I'm throwing it. Um, my son's actually catching more than me because of his color. Because his color looks just like a like a minnow type. minnow type, and it is a minnow type. And I noticed it too that um, even so if it's the that. same one, but the color's not right. Yeah, they're buying so much for that. I know. I don't want to lose the color. It's not our size. Oh, no, fatty. Come on, buddy. Yeah, pop the leaf. Yeah. Perfect. And I can, you guys can see. Oh, never mind. <laughs> never mind. See, my dad's catching the fish. Oh, man. Barely had him too. Dude, these are some big old white bass. Huge. I mean, golly, they're like jumbos. Ah. Man, he wanted it too. Ouch. I mean, he wanted that thing. Look, uh, I'm gonna measure it just for you guys. And this guy's over 15, almost 16 inch. All right, that's the catch for the day. The biggest and, one. and go ahead, Aaron, pick up two of the biggest one. Yeah. Over there, over there at that corner. This one. No, this guy. no, the one in the corner there. Yeah, the corner there. All right, turn it around. And uh, these white bass are probably about like, I don't know, they're about like, 16. This is like 15, it's like 16. Yeah, give or take. This is like three pounds, like two and a half probably. Yeah, but you know, like I'd like to say, 
um, my son here and I, we really, really, really enjoy making videos for you guys out there. So again, if you guys like, hit that like button, you know, and uh, tell a friend to subscribe and we'll just keep making videos for you guys, all right? You got anything else to say, Aaron? Besides that, we already know we'll, we'll try to give a free rod to a lucky subscriber. Come out yeah. here and fish. Enjoy, enjoy life till you can. Yep. All right. Says, all right, bye, YouTube. Bye, YouTube. All right, you know, time to go.